Well, good morning to you all. This is Renee Michelle Floyd. Um, on this morning, I am going to be doing the um, drinking of the olive oil. This whole bottle of olive oil. And the reason I'm doing that, I know you all remember me talking about this seven-day cleanse from New Body um, in Compton, Dr. Goss is the owner of um, New Body Health Food Store in Compton on Compton Boulevard. And so I'm going, I've been um, taking these herbs for the last month um, in preparation for this day, this, the um, culmination of drinking the cold press unrefined olive oil. I have to drink the whole 16 ounces. But what they said is, that it would help if I was to suck on a lemon or, you know, I'd squeeze some lemon, some lemon juice here. Um, and that's what would help the, the, the um, oil not to come back up, if you get what I say, what I mean. And so um, this is, I t already took my five uh, CKLSs. Um, that's step one. Um, and this is actually day one of the seven day cleanse. So what I was doing was the pre cleanse, meaning I was taking the herbs for all this time, preparing my body for this day, the day, day one of the seven day cleanse. So, um, it says first you take the five CKLS in the morning with at least eight ounces of spring water. Then you take the cold press unrefined olive oil um, and, uh, and then one cup of fresh squeezed lemon juice. So step one is to take the CKLS in the morning, which I've already done. And then it said to wait at least one hour before proceeding to step two, which is drinking this oil. And so right now I am about to drink, it says step two, drinking olive oil and sip on lemon juice as needed to aid in consumption of olive oil. You must drink all of the olive oil within 30 minutes, right? And so with this cleanse, with this part, with step two, you cannot lay down or anything because it will go up, you know, come up. So you have to uh, be in a place kind of like sedentary, which that is what I'm, you know, going to be doing today is sitting up today, doing my work on my laptop while I, um, let the oil work. And what this, the purpose of this is, is to cleanse and, and get all the toxins and the parasites off the walls of the colon, um, and let the, the elimination go smoothly okay so the health is in it says all it said that all sickness begins in the colon and then spreads to other parts of the body okay the purpose of the colon is to expel the toxins and waste that collects from the organs um, in the body and it says when waste matter sits in our colon it allows proteins to putrefy fats become rancid and carbo carbohydrates ferment. So that's where all the bubbling and all the gas and all that comes um, because of all the toxins and, and uh, fermentation in our colon. I've been doing cleanses for years, um, but this is the first time I've ever done this particular cleanse. And um, I believe I'm going to start scheduling to do a colonic or just a cleanse, but the next thing I want to do maybe at the end of April is a colonic. Um, and you know, I've never done a colonic before, but I've heard wonderful things about it. That stuff comes out of you that you never thought was in you from years of waste, um, that has gotten trapped in our colon. So that's what I am going to prepare myself to do after this particular cleanse. So day two, how you should eat. It says during this time, day two through day seven, you should eat 100% raw fruits and vegetables and at least a half a gallon or more of spring water and pure juices without any additives. So that means I'm going to have to be juicing 
making my own juices um, because we know that the juice you get in the store um, is, is uh, pasteurized and it takes all the nutrients out of the juice. So I have a nice juicer and so I'm going to be, you know, using it um, to full effect. Uh, you're not supposed to consume any alcohol, no coffee, no dairy, no flour, no flesh, no fried foods, no salt, no smoking, no sugar. So it's a pure cleanse uh, program that I'm going to be doing for the next seven days. So I will definitely keep you in the know, um, you know, as to how it goes. Okay, so... I am about to drink this oil, and um, so I think I'm going to show you at least the first part of this. Uh, I'm, pro I'm going to try to see if a straw would make it easier for me to consume this oil. So I have gotten a straw, and um, I'm going to take the cap off of this oil and it smells good and sweet really um i really like olive oil but i just never drank a whole 16 ounces of olive oil <laughs> so i'm going to take a sip of this lemon juice and then i'm going to take a sip and see how far i can go with the oil and i'm not going to show you how it all goes i'm going to just start it and then I will let you know what the results are tomorrow, okay? <laughs> so here goes, here's the juice, the lemon juice that I squeezed earlier this morning. Mm. Ooh, and that's good too. So here goes. Really not that bad. I drank this much, so I have to keep drinking it and I have to get it down in 30 minutes and then just rest. So with that, I will come back to you tomorrow and let you know how everything went and how everything came out, okay? <laughs> Peace. Have a good day.